So hi, this is Ryan Burkhardt. I'm working on my Model A engine and I'm going through um, the block, getting it prepped. And uh, right now I'm, I'm lapping the valves. So as you can see the difference here, this one's been done already. You can see how it's a, a dullish gray color and this one isn't. So I'm going to show you the basic steps in lapping. Um, again, this is my first time doing it, but uh, it's pretty straightforward and simple. So I'm not an expert, but uh, I don't think you can go wrong here as long as you make sure when you're done you clean all of the compound off and everything's clean uh, before you assemble the end. So what I've done is I've, I've placed the valve in and basically then what I've done is I've just I've lubricated the valve guides here and um, what I've done is I've put that in there just enough so I don't have any slop and the, the valve can go up and down real easy and spin real easy. So from here, then what I'm going to do, I'm going to actually apply a light coat of valve lapping compound around the perimeter of the valve, and uh, we'll show that next. So what I'm using is uh, a valve grinding compound from Permatex. I got it at my local store. Um, there's other ones out there, so again, this is what I chose to use. Uh, you can cho choose to use what you would like. Um, and I've got my lapping tool here. It's got a suction cup on the end and um, that's going to help us uh, spin the valve. So what I've done is I've put a little of this compound on my finger and I've just spun the valve and, and made sure that uh, seat was coated all the way. Um, that just, you just need a very little, like a pea size is what I'm using and put it all around there. So basically you're going to put the lap tool on. Sometimes it'll stick, sometimes it won't, and then you're going to spin it. And I would use two hands, a little downward pressure, and you're going to do this until you get a good um, metallic gray finish and all the pits and everything are out. These are pretty good, so I'm not doing it too long. Um, and then I'll take this off when I'm done and I'll show you what it looks like. Now when you remove it, You'll have the remaining compound down there and you want to take that off. So I've got a rag over here and I'll wipe that off and I'll show you what it looks like. Now you can see after I've wiped off the compound that was left, I've got a nice finish. And also on my valve as well. So this should make it seat really well and uh, reduce any issues when I get my engine in and start it up. So hope that helps you. Um, I hadn't found much online, so I just wanted to post it, and hopefully uh, I, this is just another uh, short Model A video to help people out and get them started. But uh, always do your research, check things out. Your local club is great resource. There's a lot of great um, knowledge in the club, so please uh, work with those folks, and uh, hope you're enjoying working on your car, driving your car. Take care.